five, four, three, two, one, zero. All engines. Hey friends, welcome to Storytime with a Scientist. My name is Bethany, she, her. I'm one of the science educators at Chabot, and today we'll be reading Aerospace Engineering by Ruth Spiro and illustrated by Irene Chan. What's an aerospace engineer? Glad you asked, Rex. So an aerospace engineer is someone who designs, creates, and tests spacecraft, like rockets, which is exactly what we'll be doing today after we finish our story. So let's get started. You ready, Rex? Okay. Hello, bird. Hi, bird. Bird can fly. How does bird fly? What do you think, Rex? How does bird fly? What do you think? She has wings. The top of her wing is curved. The bottom of her wing is flat. Bird flaps her wings. Can you flap your wings? Like this. You try. We'll work on it. Bird flaps her wings, swoosh, and they lift her into the air. Goodbye, bird. Bye bye, birdie. Wings help an airplane fly too. Does an airplane flap its wings? What do you think? Does an airplane flap its wings? No, it has engines. The engines help the plane go fast, 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 whoosh. And then the wings lift the plane into the air. Bird wants to see outer space. Her wings cannot take her there. Sorry, Bird. An airplane cannot take her there either. Sorry, airplane. So how can Bird get to space? Good idea, Rex. Bird needs a rocket. A rocket has a big engine. Fuel plus oxygen plus heat equals gas. Vroom! Hot gas shoots from the rocket. The rocket zooms up, up, up into outer space. Have fun, bird. And now, my friends, we are going to have some fun and make our very own rocket. Well, I better get suited up if we're going to start testing, designing, and building rockets. Stay tuned. Liftoff, we have a liftoff. 32 minutes past the hour. Liftoff on Apollo 11. 